everybody. My name is Tyler Cameron. I'm here with ABC Food Tours. We're at PS 134. We're about to have a day. Come on. So as a kid, I used to love going on field trips. Fridays were always the most fun day of school because it was right before the weekend. We're about to take these kids on a field trip on a Friday. What could get better? We have a big day in store for you. We're going to go do a little fitness class in. We go into a restaurant called Tim Who Want, and it's going to be amazing. You guys are going to love it. It'll be a blast. Do you like my hat? See how it looks on you. Ooh, looking good, looking good. I want to try this. You want to try it? Hey, I'll wear this one. How's this look? here in New York City. I'm 25 years old, so I've pretty much been here my entire life. Um, I got into fitness at an early age playing baseball. So out here today, we're actually working with a bunch of kids from the neighborhood, just trying to show them the importance of fitness and how much fun they can have when they're working out together, especially in groups. And it teaches them discipline. It teaches them how to work together, especially when we do things like this, how they're all together in a big group. to have some dim sum, it's gonna be a good time. Chinese food is not scary. It's to like, you know, a lot of people think it's just, you know, it's like weird food to them, but it's really not. It's, we also, you know, it's like everyone else. We use whatever we can and make it really delicious. I need you to tell me what you think of this. I never ate anything like this. It tastes like a donut. What do you think about the chicken, the chicken dumpling? Okay. Y'all be brave. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah. <laughs> Three, two, one. Yes. And? <laughs> it was a really fun experience. I wasn't, you know, sure how the kids would react to the food. They were just not afraid to try new things, which is I love. You know, growing up as a kid, I. I learned not to be afraid of eating different food and they show me that side that kind of remind me of myself when I was a kid, so it's really fun. There you go, see you do it, you just gotta believe in yourself. This doesn't have peanuts, right? How's the food? What makes the shrimp so good? Okay, so I'm sitting I'm sitting here with Melanie right now and she's absolutely 
crushing the chicken feet. Is this your first time having chicken feet? Yes. Don't be shy. <laughs> this is her first time having chicken feet and she's gone through about three of them. <laughs> so tell us what you like about the chicken feet so much. Well, food just brings everyone together. It's something that we all have in common. We all gotta eat, right? So, I mean, it's a great way to get everyone to the table. I think today a lot of people miss on eating together. And that was nice because everyone ate together. Everyone, you know, conversed with, you know, what they liked, what they didn't like. And I feel like a lot of times at home, people, you know, grab their food and go sit in front of the TV or they don't really get to sit down and eat with each other, you know, ask each other how their day was. So I really think, you know, that's just something that needs to be, you know, more instilled in the homes. I think it's something that, you know, everyone can learn from and get better with.